Home blood pressure monitors are an easy way to track your blood pressure between doctor's visits. To get the most accurate measurements, it's important to use your blood pressure monitor properly. This video demonstrates some of the best practices for using at-home blood pressure units. To ensure accurate and consistent BP readings, you need to prepare yourself and your environment. First, find a quiet, relaxing location. Sit in a comfortable chair where your arms and back are supported. Your feet should be flat on the ground. Before starting any measurement, be sure to rest for at least five minutes. Repeating this process before every measurement will ensure your readings from day to day are comparable. Additionally, you should plan to take your measurements at the same time of day. The best time is just after waking. When choosing which arm to measure, it's important to continue using the same arm for every subsequent measurement. Most guidelines recommend using your left arm. Avoid placing the cuff over clothing. If you have loose sleeves, you may roll them up. If they do not roll to the shoulder or constrict the arm, remove the garment as it may impede measurement. Extend your arm out, palm up. Keep it relaxed. Put the cuff on your upper arm about 1 inch or 2 to 3 centimeters above the elbow crease. Each ADC cuff is labeled with an artery mark. This mark should align with the artery that runs down the center of your arm. The cuff should be just tight enough that you can fit two fingers under the edge. If you're using one of ADC's wrist models, remove any jewelry or clothing that may interfere with the reading before putting on the cuff. Hold your hand palm up and slide the monitor onto your wrist with the buttons facing toward you. There should be about a half inch between your hand and the monitor. The cuff should be secure but not feel tight. When taking a reading, make sure your arm rests so that the cuff is at heart level. For an arm cuff, rest your lower arm on a chair arm or table. For a wrist cuff, this usually means propping your arm up such as with a cushion or the storage case provided. Do not attempt a measurement while holding your own arm up. The increased tension will elevate your BP. To begin the measurement, press the power button. For automatic models, the cuff inflates on its own with a push of a button. If you have ADC's semi-automatic model, you will need to press the on-off button and then pump the bulb with your other hand to begin the measurement. All models will deflate and take a reading automatically. When you start the measurement, be sure you are sitting with your back supported and your legs uncrossed, with both feet firmly on the floor. While the measurement takes place, avoid talking, eating, drinking, or any sudden movements. Some models are equipped with MAM averaging mode technology and will take a series of three readings for an average measurement. If you have MAM enabled, Remain seated and resting until all three measurements are complete. You should keep a record so you and your doctor can track your readings over time. This can be done with a booklet included with your monitor or a simple notebook. ADC's advanced models are able to electronically send data to your PC, smartphone, or tablet. From day to day, you may have abnormally high or low readings. This is common. The key is to look for trends. If your blood pressure is regularly too high, regularly too low, or is increasing over time, it is important to consult with your doctor. Remember that self-monitoring is meant to help your doctor make informed decisions about your health. Never stop medication or alter your dosage without consulting your doctor.